Welcome back to Grey Squadron Gaming. We have another exciting episode of Star Wars Legion Battle Report, episode 114. As you can this see... This is episode 115. We just had this conversation. 115. Numbers are hard. It's, it's two. He's, um, he's doing a little Don math for you guys. A little bit. You know, on, on our screen here, you have my, my army here. This is a... Uh, we, we both decided to make our own army today. We'll do some more Patreons next week just to mix it up again. And I kind of meant to do a vehicle list, and it turned into a kind of a Rogue One hop list. I don't really know what happened here. <laughs> But it's got generic, so I figured I haven't played it. It started with vehicles. There's no vehicles. There's none. There's none, no. I mean, Star Force is there, but what are you doing here? But um, I, got, I wanted Jin. She hasn't been played in a while on the channel. I brought her. She has Vigilance, her pistol, and Duck and Cover. I got Cassie with Offensive Push, his weapon, Duck and Cover, and Recon. K2, of course, with Jin's other blaster, because Jin has all the blasters. Emergency Transponders. A unit of uh, Pathfinders with Biston, Duck and Cover, and the Config, because I love that Config for overall for the Pathfinders. So we have two units of Vets, both with the Extra Trooper and the Heavy. Two Naked um, uh, Mark IIs. I need a Pikes, which I don't even have in this picture. <laughs> I should get them out at some point here. They're in a different box. They're in Star Tours. No, no, here, just gotta open the door. Here, they're, they're in here somewhere. Oh, they're in there. See the door opening? They're in there, guys. It's, it, it's fine. But they have a Capo and the Disruptor, and then two units of snipers, each with the sniper and the duck and cover, bringing up to 797. Um, big shout out to our patrons. Thank you guys for all you do. If you guys haven't got a chance yet, Go check out a couple unboxing videos we posted recently. There's the Inquisitor one that was from a few weeks back. We posted a couple Shatterpoint ones. So make sure you watch those. Um, there's a little link at the top of those videos in the description if you click them. Just help support the channel. It lets AMG know we're getting a lot more traffic and they can hopefully send us more goodies to show off to you. And if I ever get extra goodies like we always do, we give away stuff. Like, like We don't give away stuff at all. I don't know what you're For example, about. I know this isn't the Shatterpoint video, but I got an extra one of these from AMG. So I will be giving one of these away on some of the Shatterpoint videos here soon and some other goodies too. Mm -hmm. I think I got another Luminara box to give away as well. So yeah, oh, yeah. just. Make sure if you're not playing SharePoint, but you want to get into it, you want free stuff, watch our SharePoint videos. We give away stuff on there, too. But big shout out to the Commanders. Huge thanks to our Commanders, Jamal Alahadi, Alex Bingham, Anthony Minerva, Paul Jorgensen, Jess David, Archon Dan, Michael Hume, Jason Tatro, Evan Christensen, Jacob Blacka, Ryan and Peyton Archer, Thunderbound, Thomas Trotman, Sam Page, Gregory Williams, Eli, Arthur, and Walden Kaywood, Anthony Binomo, Chris Kempf, Flobit, Anthony Hosking, Ethan McKinney, Grant Sonier, Sozo, and Grim War Gamer. Huge thanks to all of you guys. We could not do this without you and all of your support. If you do not want to support us or can't support us on Patreon, please just make sure you hit that subscribe button, like the videos, comment, give us all the algorithms from the YouTubes you can. The way you worded that, if you don't want to support us, that if was If you don't like us, support us in other ways. <laughs> uh, anyways, you're seeing in this background here, we have this new little light uh, up guy here. There's a couple of them. I'm going to throw a couple of them on the screen here for a second so you guys can see them without blocking everything. So they're going to be around the board in today's game. Um, you know what? I'm going to hit the lights so people can really see how good they feel. Oh, we're getting things. some real ambiance now. They're, they're really oh, bright. Oh, that looks really cool. They look really cool on the table. Um, but they are from... I'll put the card right here. Office Dog Maze. I'll link them below as well. They make these. You can get these. Uh, I'll show you some more later. There's some Acrylix. Tons of samples of different things. There's, there's from MCP to... Legion of SharePoint, he even made a custom one for Grace Squadron Gaming, which is awesome. Different size, shapes, colors, each laser can be different colors as well, or lights, so check them out. They sent us those free to, to play with, and we're going to have them on the show, they look cool. All right, I believe there's also going to be a discount code for this. Yeah, discount code below too, I believe it's 10% off, but I'll have it posted below. Discount codes for everybody, guys. Yeah. All right, and for my list, I'm bringing Aiden Versio with Offensive Push, Situational Awareness, and her Repeater. Uh, she also has her Seeker with her. Uh, I have Bosk with Hunter and Targeting Scopes. I have two units of the Death Troopers with the DLT-19 and their Config. I have Inferno Squadron with Dell, Gideon, Targeting Scopes, and Offensive Push. And then I have three Stormtroopers with the DLT-19 and one unit of Pikes. That puts me in a 793. That makes me blue player. We'll look at my cards and see what we are going to play. Welcome back to America's favorite show, Flipboard Pass. Pass. Now to a worldwide audience. Now, Don, <laughs> thank you for being on Flipboard Pass. I'm going to I'm gonna go with ore tonight. Ooh, oh. Solid ore. Bold move. What would you like to flip or pass? Because there's no ore. Oh, I'll just go ahead and pass then. Ooh, pass for the first option. I'm going to flippy floppy. Okay. Right, where's my flippy floppies? We're going to take care of that. Some swim drums. Uh, I'm also... Going to flip uh, a supply drop, I think. So, well, don't worry, no, I'll do that for you. Good. That's what you're here and for. I, this first row just, I don't like this first row. Yeah, I, so the I first row go. really wasn't the best. So we're playing key, advance, clear. So, really, wave one came just shortly after that. So, we'll get that board set up. We'll show you what it looks like. But, like we've mentioned, we always have some giveaways going on in the great sculpture. We have a Gar Saxon card. We have a Cassian card, which is a bit timing because Cassian's on the field right now. We have some Rebel Troopers, and we have a box 
of Dark Trooper. As soon as they just landed, they thudded, just like the Dark Troopers do. They do that. So if you'd like to be interested in that, comment below. Let's look for the keyword vape for double entries. Go find other videos in the series and comment those. You get entries for those too. We compile the entries and we put them in the randomized website that spits out and says, boop, this person wins. And I say, cool, they win. Don't forget to comment, like, and share. And subscribe. Because, and subscribe, yes. Um, big shout out to Get the Games, our local game store. There's a discount code below for them. Um, and all our other sponsors. I'll go over some here in a second. We're gonna give a shout out to Star Tours, but what's another shout out? What's up, R2? Mm, you guys agree with who you think's gonna win? Mm -mm. We'll see. So we talked about the lights, you know, we talked about those new those new things all around the board here. They're really cool. Um, I said I would show more of the things, but I haven't grabbed them yet, so I will grab them here shortly and show them. Oh, I did grab them, they're right here. Here's some other options. There's way, way more you can choose from on the site. So we got, it's hard to see it on lit up, but this is the Death Star one with some Arabish. We've got the uh, Office Dog Minis, that's the name of his company. Another Gray Squadron plate there. And then the this one for MCP. It's a group. It's group. It's Major a group. warning dangerous wanted by Xander Defense Force for Tom Fullery, burglary, kidnapping, and smuggling. So yeah, they all light up. You can get all different ones. There's way, way more options than that too. And you can make custom stuff too. So check it out. Big shout out to Legion Train. Everything on this table except for those lights, Star Tours, and the Escape Pod is from Legion Train. This is actually two of their table sets, so check it out. Discount code below. The mat itself is from Grey Matter Gaming. We play pretty much exclusively now on their mats, I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, check them out. Uh, what else? Oh, real quick. Curled Paw are the, are the awesome curled tokens we use, and the holders for all our stuff is from J Squared. Discount code below. My army, as you can see, I infiltrated them barely. Scouted them up because they have scout free with Mr. Advanced Positions. Jin infiltrated, Cassie infiltrated, he became, no, he didn't infiltrate. He scouted two because of Advanced Position. Jin did infiltrate. Even though she probably didn't really need to, she could have just scouted as well. Pikes, K2's there. We got two Mark IIs back with two of the scouted up vets. He's got a unit of Pikes, Storms, and then starts his Kunga lineup. Do, 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 do. And Aiden and Boss right there in that scrum. Round one, you guys. Know how this works, round one. But I went with standing orders, it's a classic. He went with tactical strike, it's Eid Verso and three troopers. It's a really good amount of troopers issuing order there. When Eid Verso or a friendly special force unit has a face of token, when it activates, it may reduce its maximum speed to one. If it does, it gains steady and tactical. What a great card to start with! So, we'll probably see a Mark II get deleted right away, but that's okay. Let's get started. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and start with the uh, uh, death troopers here. We are going to reduce their speed. We're going to do two speed one moves. We're going to do one here and then one right here. And then they will get two aims for that tactical. And with mm. steady, we'll be able to shoot after that. I'm going to go ahead and shoot into the front mark one and stay out of range of the or mark two and then stay out of range of the back one. So we will shoot and go to the dice box. Okay. Welcome to the first dice roll of the game. We're going to find out what dawn we got tonight, guys. Is it last week dawn or standard steady dawn? I really hope for her last week dawn. Ooh, last week dawn hurt. I doubt it. We got two aim tokens. We got precise two. We have two reds and a white for our DLT, four blacks for our standard gun. We're not using the suppressive one because the courage two is not going to matter. Um, he will have light cover, eye search to hit. All those things. Yep, you need all those aims. We'll spend the first aim. Hope you blank each time. Nope. And there you go. So one that will away. go to cover. So you're looking at a six pack, sir. Six pack. I have four health, so I gotta save at least three of these to survive. That's that's a tall order for white dice with surging. You never know though. Unfortunately, I have to re-roll that, but this is gonna come down to this. Ah! We survive with one. Look at my stack attack. We've got a special force. Let's go way up here to the snipers that are up here. Uh, even though the Death Troopers win, I usually like to shoot something that hasn't gone. They have this nice range. What is this going to be? Four-ish? Five? Definitely five. Mm -hmm. On our Death Troopers. And the only cover they have is this light cover, which we should take a moment, Don, to talk about cover. All the buildings are heavy. The light-up things are heavy as well. And same with the vehicles, which we'll call this and this is a vehicle. The mounds are light cover, difficult training over, and all the burned-out buildings and scatter you see around the board are also just light cover. Mm -hmm. With that said, I will shoot over the light cover hill into did, the death tree. Did you mention what our key positions are? Oh, key positions. That, that, yeah, I did not. Right there, my little, uh, the girl dancing sign. And Don, what did you pick? My little uh, boxes back oh, there. Oh, the boxes the out here. Yeah. Okay, let's go All shoot right. them. We'll have shoot light cover me. down and done with the sharpshooter. Aim for the first action. Shooting for the second light cover goes away with sharpshooter one. I have surge crit, high velocity, and pierce one. It's a solid start. Not what you want to see. Let's do that again. Oh, at least we got one, the one, black belt. One dead dark trooper. Death trooper. Right, we got one more health to try to take off of that Mark II. So we'll go with the stormtroopers that we gave an order to here. They're going to move up to this building, and then they will shoot into the 
Mark two. Tried to pull it. Half the stack was core. Didn't happen, but that's okay. Yeah, it's, it's fine. He's absorbing two shots, I guess. That's something. All right, so you got your four white, two red DLT Stormtrooper shot here. Range three, heavy cover because of the suppression. Surging to hit. That's a good, uh, good start there. And uh, we're going to lose two to cover, so you're rolling for two. No way you can survive again, but if you could, man, that'd be some money. No, he doesn't block any. All he right, did. Good. We got Special Forces again. So even that Mark II definitely wasn't going to live if we did it. <laughs> uh, we're going to take an aim. We're going to shoot those purple boys and heavy. We'll right. down the light. Let's go. Same as last time. Black, white, high velocity, pierce one, surging to hits. And the heavy down the light. Got one. We got the black this time. Can we get the white again? We do. Oh, one goes with the cover. Gonna... Pierce one. I should kill the storm. I mean, I killed a death trooper. The purple ones are death troopers. So we'll go with them before they get any more damaged. They'll hold on to their suppression, their courage too. They are going to reduce their speed and they are going to do a double move. They're going to move right next to Bosk. And then right back here, we're going to take the nice range four shot onto the Mark II there. And okay. see what happens. Thanks to Steady and Tactical, he can do that. All right, so it is two reds and a white for our DLT, and then just three suppressive black dice because we have to use our config at range four. We got two aims from our tactical and steady action. Now we'll start with an aim here. Good start both times. And we'll spend the other aim. All right, so we're going to lose two to cover. You're looking at three, unfortunately. Ooh, I am not dying no matter what I roll here, but let's hope we roll some paint, too. We block one, take two, and it's Okay, spread. we've got... This much left in the stack. There's five cores. Surely we're going to pull a core now, right? Surely, yeah. No. No. <laughs> we're going to pull all the special forces to roll. All right. I didn't want another one because the Pathfinders, but it's okay. We're going to have to be a little more, more offensive here to kind of slow this little rolly roll down that they got going on here. So we're sure. going to come here and put him there. I'm going to recohere them in a way they get some cover back if any of those things shoot me, but I can still kind of shoot him too. And then we're going to go ahead and take a shot onto Aiden with okay. our range four config. And Biston, so that way we can pull that shield off, hopefully. That's rude. I said the config, the whole reason I moved out was to get to range two to not use the config. So it's going to be two whites per model for range three for my river guys. It's going to be eight white dice. Biston himself adds four whites and a black. He gives you that ion keyword, which took away my shield. Which takes away the shield before he even gets to use it, so that's yes. nice. He has, I'm sure, heavy cover. Heavy cover, yeah. yeah. Heavy cover, I search to hit. That's a good shot, buddy. It's one crit. It's a good shot. It's a lot of blank white, isn't it? Good shot. Oof. Hiding to deal with here. Oh, she takes take it. the damage, though. All right, I'm going to go over here to Inferno Squadron. They are going to reduce their speed and get steady and tactical, so they're going to move twice. Two aims from tactical, kicking in there. My poor Mark right twos, guys. And we will just line them up in a Congo here. Some so of you might be a little shot. Might be thinking, Joe, why'd you stick them out there? Well, there's two reasons. One, it puts pressure on him and makes him do what he's doing. Respond with all his heaviest threats to take them out. Usually I pull them a little earlier, but even if they go down, they did the job of absorbing his they three did, best attacks. They did absorb an alpha, but I'm I'm down two activation to you already, so I need to, need you did? to wipe no. out the things it, that I need to It was 100% the way yep. to go, because that helps tie you up, but um, yep. yeah. All right, so we get two reds from Gideon, two blacks from Dell, two blacks from our unnamed, unknown associate. Three aims because of the retinue and the uh, tactical. I have lethal, I have marksmanship, I search to hit... Your dice rolls haven't been bad off the bat. So we'll just we'll just put it all up to hits. Um, we'll lose one to cover, and then we'll make it lethal. So five pierce one. One day, and I'm definitely losing my Mark twos, but they, they did a good job absorbing the alpha. They, they took a lot, yep. Block one, it's pierced. Full health one would have went down. Put in my stack. Half speed core at this point, right? No. Nope. No, no, it's not. He shuffled pretty thoroughly, too. I shuffled really good. We're going to pop K emergency transponders. K2 is who I did bounty with Bosk as well. So we're gonna have an aim, which gives cast name thanks to their lovely teamwork. Sure. Because I think I'm going to break this in time right away, guys. Um, and he's the reason I did the tr transpires and not um, his quick thinking is because he's just out of range for anybody. Yeah. There's his ISFs yeah. who moved up. And I don't have to move up much. It's just like almost to the edge, but not quite. Mm -hmm. There we go. We're going to go right to there. So I'm just barely in range for our first. And then we're going to go ahead and shoot. We've got great. five white dice into Jin's blaster with suppressive Pierce one. We do search to crit. He's got heavy cover and a search token. Let's see what we can do. I have a name. Do it. Not a good start. We got one crit pierce one. That's that's one wound. All right, one wound on two. Right, I'm gonna go ahead and go with Aiden. She has one suppression. She's gonna hold on to it. She's courage three. She's fine. Uh, I'm gonna quick thinking for my first to get an aim and a dodge. We're then gonna do the reduce your speed, gain your tactical, and all the good stuff. We're gonna move right over here, which gives me a line of sight onto Mr. K2 and gives her an additional aim. And she will shoot into him in heavy cover. There's her, and there's K2. 
Just a shot in the mark. I've got heavy cover. I've got armor one. He's got two aims, two reds, two whites, and a black with impact one and pierce critical one. one. Critical one. No pierce. No pierce. No pierce. That's the only thing that gun's missing, but it'd be too good with the yeah, two. Yeah, with, with marksmanship, it's hard. <laughs> All right. Man, our attack dice uh, are very different yeah, across so we're the just board. Gonna, we're just going to put it up to three crits, I think. So cover will eat. That will spend the two aims to make two hits, two crits. Okay. Three crits for Mr. K2. We block two with three. Oof. We have finally a core. It's a little late to the Mark II. We'll go with this front vet here. This front vet has a couple options. He's he's constantly his options. We've got. I like this one. I am. I am too far off for everyone else. So let's go with the aim. We'll just shoot him right there. Sounds great. We got an aim. We have five blacks. We have the extra trooper. Four whites for the heavy with critical two. We do surge to hit natively. He's got heavy cover and a surge. Troop. See what happens. Let's cock. Let's reroll this one right here. That's helpful. Okay, so we start with this. It's not a bad start. This will be one of our criticals. It's a pretty darn good start, actually. We'll the, it's a really good start. We'll spend the aim on these two. We'll get our other critical. And then we're going to lose two to cover. So you're still looking at two Oof. or six. That's, That's a vet shot right there. That is not great for me. Oh, Oof. Three, that's, so that's down, you, one so name to one regular guy. Yeah, it just goes, just goes to get it. All right, go to the stack here. It's a core. We're going to go with the purple stormtroopers right here. He's just going to go ahead and move right up to the corner of the building here. And we will all take a shot into K2 because that's the only target that they can actually see. Okay. All right, this is basically just crit fishing. It's going to be four whites, two reds. It does have impact one, but we have heavy cover to, do, to eat through first. So we'll see what happens. That's actually... Not bad because this will surge to hit. Cover will eat these two, and then impact will kick this to a crit. So it's no two crits. There. Hey, your, your intro uh, offensive dice have been pretty good so far. Can my defensive dice keep up? No. no. Two wounds. We got our Capalicious Pikes here. They're just going to move on up to the edge here. Like so, sticking out by those stairs. Sure, sure. We'll reposition everybody so they can kind of keep cover. Sure. And somewhat see what they're shooting at. Alrighty. And then we'll uh, we'll take a shot on something. I'm thinking the purple storms might be the best option, or probably the only good option. I'm gonna say I think they're probably your only good option. So yeah, we'll shoot them. All right, just five pikes with the cap, but that's five black dice at range three. I have my disruptor, which is two blacks to red. The impact won't matter here. I am touching the piece of terrain, so he gets no cover here. And I have a surge token. Let's see what happens. It's a good uh, good roll for you for sure. It's a very good roll. And yeah, I think everything on that side has gone right. Except for boss, yep. Except for boss, yeah. Let's we'll spend the search token to make it a nice six pack. Just a six pack for these stormy boys, no problem. Let's see what happens. It all depends on the red dice. You're taking uh, half take again, my sack. It's a core. We're gonna go to the stormtroopers back here, and unfortunately, this is gonna be a nice double move turn. We're gonna move and just move to the end of Star Tours here, just to be safe. And R two and Star Tours hits Star Tours to full and smushes them. Thanks, R two, for the rebellion. We've got a core. Let's maybe these vets here because all the other core options are either dead or have gone at this point. Sure. So let's um let's kind of bring them up a little bit here. Let's let's start let's start pushing up with these boys here. We're gonna go okay. right here. Moving up there. And then we're gonna shoot um I'm thinking possibly the death troopers, but maybe I am. I'm gonna take some look at for repo here and tell you guys. Okay. We're shooting the black death troopers. You saw the stack earlier, five blacks, so the other guys with the extra, four whites, critical two for the heavy. He's got light cover from the... Oh, you have heavy cover because you have a suppression, don't you? I one? do have a yeah, suppression, so yeah. Heavy cover all around. They really didn't matter yep. then. Uh, which tells me, do I do I switch to Iden, guys? She has heavy cover and a dodge, but she doesn't surge natively. That's true. You, if you, <sighs> killing Iden would be huge. I wouldn't kill her, but wounding her to the point to getting close to... Yeah, we're going to shoot Iden, actually. Okay. There's a dodge then in play here. So one dodge versus native surging. Yeah, I think I want that won't even be a huge tax no worries just the two crits get through you'll dodge one yeah so cover eats the one just one I'll dodge one hide and rolls for one and she's fine it's fine either. i got my sack here it's gonna be mr bosk himself he is just gonna step over here by iden he will take a shot into k2 can you use a little trouble he does get an aim because of hunter yep yep it checks out. He's a little bit of trouble. He has heavy cover armor one, but Bosk has surging to crit and pierce. So. Surge to crit and pierce one. It's going to be four whites, one red with an aim and precise, precise one. One crit there. We will spend the aim on these three. It's going to be two crits, pierce one. That's <laughs> just what you needed, huh? There we got he's, him. He's down. You get your bounty early. Ooh, that hurts. I'm just, Rebels dropping like flies in this game, guys. Um... Great task done. We're gonna go with Jen. Okay. Jen's just in range to get that ISF, so she will quick thinking to give herself 
an aim, and a dodge. Sure. And then we're going to shoot. She has, she's currently in her range three config. So it'll be two blacks and a white pierce with sharpshooter shooting at that gun. Two see. blacks, a white pierce, one. Um, sharpshooter one brings the heavy on a light. I do search crit natively with an aim. It's got light cover. It's one crit so far. Good start for me. Two crits. Two crits, pierce one. At least nothing's going to cover. But. Two pierce one. All righty. Can Gideon hold on? Yep. I will spend the surge, and it will get pierced, so he takes one wound out of that, and he's still kicking. Last in my sack is going to be these uh, pikey boys back here. They're going to just double move up to Star Tours to make sure that if they need to be used for something other than claiming this point later, that they can do that. Okay. So. Back to me. Okay, last unfortunately, but not least. Don's hotter than hot dice continue to roll in this last couple weeks. We're going to take Cassian. He'll just take an aim for his uh, first action. We'll spend the aim to make his pistol because he's in a pistol with a big long shot, and we'll just shoot into him. Alrighty. Two reds and a black, surging to hit. He has heavy cover, but I have marksmanship with an aim, and uh, let's see what happens. And he's dead. We will barely kill him. We're going to spend the aim to marksmanship that to a crit. Double red blanks, too. Yep, yep. Dice have been hot on one side of the table. That's in round one. I killed an ISF, which is good, except for I lost K2 and two Mark IIs. The Mark IIs are careless, but K2 was just some unfortunate luck on defense dice and his hot, hot critacular dice. So, um, there is no a activation bonus uh on my side anymore but it's gonna be a messy round two i feel like i feel like it's gonna be like a messy messy round two. i feel like i'm gonna lose some vet units probably <laughs> Really dressed tonight. We got double one pips in round two. We got pulse scan odds Iden versus card. She gained sharpshooter two, one aim token at the end of her activation. She gains one dodge token in the standby. I went with the like other version of her card pretty much in a weird way. It's crack shot, which casting gains gunslinger name token at the end of his activation. He gets standby token. So they're both going to be standing by at the end of their things. One has a pulse, one has a crack. Let's do it. They're going to shoot some things. So I gave my order obviously to casting because that's the card. Um, she vigilance dodge herself. They have independent if you're wondering where those came from. And she gave her order to herself. I started us off. I won the roll off. Let's let's let me think what I want to do. Put my stack because we don't want to take cast and then put them out in the middle of nowhere. So let's definitely go with these guys. All right. Um, there, no question. And take an aim for the very first action here. Sure. Um, I'm gonna shoot into in this pile of death here. You know, I was thinking the death troopers because they have light versus heavy, and if I kill two or two wounds, it at least takes some dice away versus Iden who has like five health left, six health left. Six health left. Yeah, with heavy cover, the stormtroopers are. Would be the easiest thing to hit because you know they don't. Yeah, they don't have any don't any fun defensive tech at all. But I think it's got to be the darks. Okay. Okay, you guys know it. it's five blacks with the troopers, the extra four whites with critical two into light cover black death troopers. Death troopers. With names. Uh, mm, some natty crits on one of my critical hits so far. So we're gonna spend the aim to roll these two. We still have one critical left and surging. We'll get the other critical. We will awesome. lose one of those hits to cover. So you're still looking at a five pack. I'm not too not too mad about that. I would say you shouldn't be. Lose uh, two. Two, two. Man. Here you go my stack here. It's a stormtrooper. We are gonna go with these guys. Um, they will take an aim and they'll shoot into the vets that have not gone yet to see if we can't at least stop them from getting an aim and a shot at me back. I gotta love when both players play that one pip and they don't even use the person with one pip because they both don't want to stick their guy out in the middle of nowhere. So they're just they're just biding that time, you know. It's that kind of you're feeling it out to that first date. Like, do I, do I, do I, do I, do I kiss? Do I not kiss? Do I hang back? Do I not hang back? You know, it's that whole need, kind of dance. To make it awkward. All right, so we got a name token. We got two reds, four whites, precise one into heavy cover bets. I will spend the aim. He <laughs> converts uh, two out of three. We'll give you two. Sure, okay. Oh man, that, that hurts. I block one at least. Yeah, I even flipped one. So do I block the whole attack now? No, I don't no, think that's no. how that works. Man. We're gonna we're gonna go with this unit right here. They do have a suppression, so we're gonna see if we get an aim or we don't get an aim. No aim, no aim, no aim, no aim. No aim. No aim. Woo, woo. That's okay. We're still going to just shoot into the um Are they close enough? They're a little further back. I don't know if we're gonna shoot the death troopers since they're a little further back, but we're definitely gonna You can definitely no, you can't get the death troopers, so I think the only target you have right now is the red storms. That's not true. I think we might take the purple storm to see if we can take a unit out. All right. They did lose a guy just last time. So it was going to be four blacks to the five, with four whites, critical two. He has heavy cover. I have no aim or anything because I was suppressed a little bit here. We will get one crit. So it's just going to be just one crit, unfortunately. Just one crit from a stormy boy. But it takes out my DLT. All right, we'll go to the stack here. It's a core. We'll go with the purple guy and see if we can't save his little life. They'll roll off the suppression. That's, that's how Don does, guys. We're just going to go ahead and double move him right back here. Hide, and, hide him nice and snugly back here behind snugly this building. Snugly back there. So in my sack, we finally got one. It's perfect. We're going to take the aim 
and shoot into his um the black death troopers yep and then we'll go to the next try one. to get my heavy down okay he has suppression so it is heavy down like my sharpshooter i have a black and white surging to hit pierce one all those lots of stuff with an aim let's see what we can do we got, the, ah, we got the crit though. Ah. The heavy's definitely dead. Can we get one more hit to make him think about it? No, that will go away to cover, but one pierce one kills the heavy. Man. I go to the sack here. It's the stormtroopers. We're going to go with the guys that are hidden behind Star Tours here. They're going to move just to the end of Star Tours. And it's a conga line them out just enough to see everybody. Conga line and shoot. There we go. Okay. All right, so it's two reds, four whites. No cover on these vets. Take the hit. It'll be three, four. It'll be four. Just going to roll. Just going to roll some nail white heads again, guys. Done. I blocked two though. Ah, huh? Rude. I, I, do I do I count yes, that? Okay. Yes, yes, you definitely do. Pike attack. <sighs> this pike's gonna climb this time, guys. He can he can feel the climbiness. <laughs> no, this this time's this time's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. We tried climbing earlier and had to reshoot the video because it didn't fit. So nope. This time we're this time we're gonna fit though because I didn't I wasn't that far forward with my leader this time. It's true. So this time I definitely got the way to get into there. Look at that. He's got it, guys. We've had to take up the whole top, <laughs> but we're there. You know, we're, we're, we're sure? there. You're sure there. Who okay. are we shooting at? I think that lone death trooper. The lone death trooper and heavy cover? All right. I mean, we definitely have a surge if we want to use. Probably going to save that for defense. But we have it. We have five black dice for the regular guys, two blacks and a red for the disruptor. Seven blacks, one red coming in. Heavy cover, death trooper. You that's don't, You don't save that for defense because you surge defensively. That's also very true, sir. You reminded me. Thank you. I'm going to spend it for that. We'll drop two off the red. The red won't hit for me right now. It's kind of weird, but the blacks hit at least, so I can't complain. And still throwing three into a one health unit. Come so. on, just do one blank here. No, nope, just they, natty blocks. I'm going to go to my sack here. It's the purple guys. So before they get shot and whittled down again, we're going to recover to get our config back. It's back. Then we're going to spend it, and we are going to shoot into the... Um, Pathfinder's there. Okay. We'll go to the next one. I'm going to go ahead and probably duck cover to my web, but we'll see what he rolls first, I All guess. All right, so I got three blacks, two reds, one white. Surge to hit into the heavy cover. Tice. So yeah, Pyro's going to eat these three because you're going to duck and cover. cover. It'll be three. Danger sense. I'll get to roll four here at least to try to, try to negate some of these. Gosh. Block two. Take one. We got Jen. She's got a dodge from Vigilance. Let's go ahead and move her up. Moving on up. To the to east the side. side. We're going to bring her just back as far as we can here. Because <sighs> I need to be able to see him. He really, really wants to kill this lone. Well, she has... Oh, no touch him. He, she has Pierce, at least, so there's a better chance of she doing it. She does have a good chance of it. Not great. Two blacks and the white. I have sharpshooter one. Heavy cover down to light. Crit, Pierce. Yeah, we need, to, we need some hits. I have no aim, unfortunately. We got it. This will go away to cover. Ah, that will pierce it. All right, go to the stack here. It's a core. I didn't want to see these guys, but we'll go with the pikes. And they're just going to double move to hang out with these stormtroopers over here. Chilling nice start to us. See if they want to buy some spice. Go to my stack. All I have left is should be two special forces. There's one. Go to the pathfinder. Save three. I'm going to try to roll it off. I get one off. So not enough for two actions. Um, just one action. So and no recover shoot. So Bistin no doesn't get shoot. his bucket of dice. No, I just get... Don't get the bucket dice exactly. What do we got option wise? We'd have to. Ooh, you're even out of range three for everything too. Nice. We could use your kind of big. It's only four white dice though. I don't love that. Oh, I'm dauntless. I can you just could move and shoot. I can just move up and take an expression. Go back up to three and shoot. That's a hundred percent what we're doing. Alrighty. We're gonna move up and shoot. Sounds great. Okay, we dauntless up to the barrels, the crates. We are now within range of the, dark, the death troopers. They have no cover here. Biston cannot recover right now because he was suppressed. So we got two, four, six, eight white dice. He's just going to throw the normal two white dice at range three. We surged a hit. Let's see if we can get anything. We got two. Two, two is something. Two is something. Two is something. Not what I was hoping for, but I can't complain. Too many chillikers, Batman. We got them both. All right, I'm going to go ahead and go with Aiden now. I will go ahead and quick think to get a aim and a dodge. Oh, she does have one suppression. Let's see if she holds on to it. She holds on to that, so that's fine. Uh, she will shoot into Jin with Sharpshooter 2. She'll have no cover. Okay. Jin's, I'm going to say it right now, unless she blinks, he's taking a dodge, reduction, or a suppression reduction cover, just for that danger sense. All right, so we've got two reds, one black, two whites, in, or um, critical one, two aims, search to hit. She's got a dodge. Whoa. That's one. Might be your... Only bad roll so far yeah. offensive in the whole game. But you have two aims, so it's fine. I do fine. have two aims. I think I'm going to spend one aim and re-roll dice. And then we'll bump this up. You'll dodge one. You're looking at three. I'm going to duck and cover to be able to get a danger sense to roll four against this at least. Sure. Oof. 
Four blanks okay. is pretty good for me. So I'll take three woes. Here we go with Mr. Cassia now that Jin's gone. Or, um, excuse me, Iden's gone. Cheer. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to tap our offensive push. Move up to the corner of this building right here. Okay. Um, so we'll get two aims, one for the offensive push, one for the tactical keyword that's built in. Yep. And we had one aim from the order token we had, too. Sure. We have a Ritzel and Pistol and Fig, and we have Gunslinger right now. So I will have to spend long shots for these, which is fine. I kind of knew that was coming. So yeah, we're going to shoot, because um, I have to spend long shots anyways, we have Pierce natively. Let's shoot the Death Troopers in the back. Okay. And let's shoot... Jin, you got a dodge. Oh, it's a tough call. Um... I, I just or Iden has a dodge. Either Iden or the Stormtroopers. I'll think about the second one. Right. Three aims. I spent one to make this range two gun range three. It's two reds and a black. Pierce one. Onto these Death Troopers. Uh, what do you have? Light cover there? I, I, have, I have heavy cover because of the suppression and the bucket. Wow. So we'll Good. spend an aim to make it a crit to so kill one Death Trooper. All right, one dead Death Trooper there. And then we'll spend the last aim to make this a range three. We're going to shoot your Stormtroopers now that we know we don't have any more crazy aims for sure. anyone harder to hit. I believe they will also have heavy cover. So unfortunately it's two hits. We'll go to just a suppression on them. All right, going to my stack here. It's going to be boss. This one's going to be a dead uh, death trooper. So check that right away. Uh, we're going to aim and shoot into Jin. Okay. All right, so we got four whites, one red, search to crit, two aims, one from Hunter, one from the action, and heavy cover. Pierce one, suppress it. No sharpshooter for you this time, sir. No sharpshooter. It's okay. Just uh, just two crits so far. They were all natty crits, so it's going to be fine. Yeah, hey, those were surges, not natty crits. Uh, we'll spend the first aim. We have precise one, so we'll get to reroll three. One crit here. Oh, uh, okay. We'll spend the aim again, because it's not doing anything in heavy cover. Uh, yep, so those will go away to cover. So it's two pierce one. And I have a, I have two suppression you from the attack and from the duck and cover. Uh, do I want to duck and cover another one? I do, actually. I want to make sure she lives here as best as possible. So All right. I think another, another suppression to roll a total. Against these two, I'm rolling five. You are rolling five. I get two. I pierce one of those. You pierce one, so I stop a wound and take a so wound. So one wound. You guys can't tell. I'm going with the sniper. It looks like we have to get to about there, Don. Does that look right? Uh, something pretty close to that. Okay, so we're going to move up just, whoop, just to push it up slightly. Sure thing. And we'll uh, reco here, this boy, way over here. And then we're going to... um. Take a shot and see if we can get lucky. Okay, hey, black, white, heavy on the light. Pretty much looking for a crit or two hits here. It's going to be a tough call, but let's see if we can do it. We got two hits. One will drop the cover there. and pierce one kills the other death. Man. That is the end of round number two. Um, I did take up to four. Or I, I, I reversed the name server. Jin's Jin. at four wounds because of things, so that's not good. Um, but other than that, what, what else did we lose this round? I don't, know. I don't think I lost anything. I lost no, one. You... You one lost, Pathfinder? I think one one vet. I one vet, one Pathfinder, I think, something like that. Or maybe I killed two vets this round. Something know. like that. I took out a Death Trooper unit and a couple more from that Death Trooper unit. I yeah. think that was it. Oh, I finished, almost finished off that guy before he ran, right? Yep. Something like that. Let's go to round three, see how it plays out. Jin's in a little bit of trouble. I feel like one cup was coming, but I didn't know it was ambush. I, I, I was like... The boss bomb one you don't usually bring, but I was like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Generally bring that. I, I figured one pip was coming, so I was like, I didn't want to play the one pip duel. Jin's one pip isn't as great from that far away either. She wants to be closer, and she's kind of hurt. So I went with her three pip. Complete the mission. That's three troopers. She gains low profile. When a friendly trooper unit is issued an order, it may gain a suppression. When a friendly trooper unit with a face-up order token activates during its activation, it cannot become panicked or suppressed. At the end of the activation, it may remove one suppression token. So it's a nice little card to... Build up those danger sense keywords. I gave it to her. Didn't take the suppression because she already has three and she has death cover. She can always have the fourth for free. Gave one to Cassian with the suppression, one to the vets with suppression who have duck cover. She vigilance dodging herself. Independent over here. He gave his to the uh, death, death troopers. troopers. Understandable. He doesn't want them to die instantly. Okay, he starts us off. All right, so we're going to go with the Death Troopers. They have one more suppression on them. They're going to hold on to it. Okay, of course, they're fine. Uh, and we need to keep my thumbs alive now. So we are going to go ahead and. Do the good old fashioned American runaway. Okay. Good old fashioned American runaway. Okay. We're going to go with Urso. Um, since she has a face of order token, I don't have to roll anything. She can't become um, suppressed or panicked during this activation. And I have danger sense, so I don't have to roll off my, my um, suppression. So I'm going to keep it all. Hanging out there with her. Gives me two actions still because of my lovely ability. We're going to go ahead and I think we're going to take a shot and move. I think I want to keep her alive. And even if I duck and cover without situation awareness and his crit nattiness, it's going to get in trouble. So I think we're going to shoot the storms. Okay. And then we're going to just fall back to like right behind this wall over here. That seems pretty logical. Yeah. So do you want to just fall back? Like I want to see line of sight first. Oh. Have you done a light on those stormtroopers? Pierce one, surging the crits. Two blacks, no white. 
Oh, crit. I forgot, crit. Phew. Okay, so one Pierce, one in the Stormtroopers. Alrighty, that's Stormtroopers. That's right, we're going to go to the stack here. It's going to be Mr. Bosky Bosk himself. He's going to take an aim. He's going to shoot into the Rebel Bats that have lost two Bats. They have a dodge, but cover and stuff like that. All right, it's going to be two, I'm sorry, one red, four whites, search to crit, per, uh, suppressive, Pierce one, precise one, heavy cover with dodge. That's going to be two crits. Just a natty crit and a surge to crit, eh? We'll spend the aim on these three with our precise one. That one's just going to go to cover, so you're looking at two pierce one. You can't spend the dodge again because they're all crits. It's all dodge rolling tonight, and you'll and pierce that, that one. So, so two. two more down. Okay, we're going to go with these guys here. We're going to go ahead and take a... Um, I'm not debating if I want to aim or I just want to shoot and move. Yeah, I think we're going to shoot and move back to here. Sounds like a plan. So I'll, I'll go ahead and move now. Just shooting these stormtroopers. The stormtroopers over there by the star tours, and then we're going to move these guys back here. Sure. Just to kind of hide them a little bit. Yep. Once again, we didn't roll suppression off. Um, I think I still have to technically roll the suppression, so let's yes. just try that. It won't matter. They do lose one, so they'll keep two, but with their border token, they don't have to worry about that because sure. guard. So four whites, critical two, one black, surge to hit, uh, heavy cover. So we're gonna oh, so see you two crits and Rude. raise you two crits, Mr. Bosk Bosk. Block one, take one. So that's a dead storm. Oh, we're doing the flippy you thing, You said right? no, though, unfortunately. Battle dice? You said Battle no. Dice. So sec here. It's going to be Aiden. She'll go ahead and take a quick thinking. She'll get an aim and a dodge. And then she's going to shoot into Cassian. Okay. All right, so Cassian's going to have a heavy cover. I have two reds, two whites, one black, critical one. With an aim, with marksmanship. Oh, my gosh. Um, I'll take that. Yeah, it's gonna either be, make it one hit or one crit getting through. That's... One either way, I guess. So we'll just we'll just spend the one. We'll spend one to make a red a crit for. Okay, that's gonna get through cover. So right now I'm rolling one with dangerous sense and suppression. I'm rolling another one. I'm gonna duck and cover because I can't be suppressed this round to add another dice to roll three here. Yeah. I don't see why you wouldn't here. And I'll block it. For my stack, we got a special forces going with these guys here. Sure. We're gonna shoot Iden. She has actually only light cover, which we're gonna take away with sharpshooter. That's true. So we'll do that, and then after the shot, we're actually gonna start moving them because they're kind of far away from the target. I know we have a few turns still, but they have a good amount of distance to cover. They do. So I think we're going to start moving him up. We're going to kind of push him in a little bit there. That sounds good. And we're going to see how far I can put him back, and then I'll recover. Right. Black and white dice are shaped here. high velocity, all that fun stuff. She has no cover. Let's hope for some paint. We got one. Pierce one. All right. Yeah, it takes a little. On my stack, it's a core. We'll go with the red guys here. They have one suppression. They're going to hold on to it. Ooh, a rare hold on gonna, suppressive shot. Uh, we're just going to pop a shot into the vets back there that they can see and see if we can't put a suppression on. It's a heavy cover shot, so just two crits coming up from it now It is. On. Two reds, three whites, search to hit, heavy cover. <laughs> Almost. Almost. <laughs> one crit. Just one crit, two hits needed. Oh, God, your dice. Okay, let's see if I can block you guys. No, I'll, I'll lose one. Put in my stack. It's special force. We'll go these snipers. They're going to aim and shoot Aiden. Sounds like a plan. Okay, it's a black white again. All the keywords you guys know by now. With an aim token this time, heavy on a light. Good start. Yep. I like it. I had a feeling it was going to happen. Just a suppression. It. Out of the stack here, it's a core. We'll go with the white stormtroopers here that got a suppression. They're going to get it held on, so they're just going to pop a shot into the uh, vets and see what we can do. Okay. All right, so we got three whites, two reds. They have light cover from their suppression. And we get to throw a dice on the ground. Uh, so it's just going to be one after cover eats the other one of these here. Okay. Oh, we blocked this one at least. Alrighty. Go to my stack. We've got pikes that we haven't been moving around to measure things with. Of course, they're going to pikes. They're going to aim, and they're going to shoot into, I think, I think uh, Miss, Miss, Miss Aiden. Alrighty. Yeah, this is five blacks for the other guys. Two blacks right for the disruptor again. With the surge, open and an aim. Into heavy cover, Aiden Verso with the dodge. Jeez. That's a good start, but man, my red. Come on, red. We got an aim, though. We'll, we'll convert you, hopefully. Just doesn't like me today. Sure. They're converted. There it goes. Two so, and a dodge. We'll take away the, the hits. You have three crits still remaining. Three tried to play with here. Two we'll take two wounds out. The stack. It's pikes. We'll go with these guys. They're just going to kind of move this direction. And then we'll try to go here behind the building as much as we can. But we'll shoot into our friends, the, uh, the vets. Just going to be four blacks into light cover vets. So one after cover. We're oh. okay again. Yeah. stack. We have our last much force is. We're going to see if we can rally anything off here. Oh, man. I don't know if I wanted both of them off, but I'll take it. They get all the actions in the world. Unfortunately, a recover shoot would sound nice right now, but... <laughs> Into the a... one stormtrooper. <laughs> yeah, it's not, it's not a great shot. So I think what we're going to do is we're actually going to move up 
and shoot into Iden Versio. I'm just thinking how I want to move. I'm thinking, I think a guy's gonna look something like enough to get him sure. and his buddies to see her and then shoot. So somewhere in this range. I, I gotta do some measurements so let's see what it's gonna be. Alrighty. Here's gonna be eight white dice because I had to move and not recover. So let's do two, four, six, eight white dice to dodge and have cover. Let's see what we get. I surge. Oh, good, good. Well, these good two surges will drop off and then the hit and crit well, will stay. One. Just the crit then. Block it. All right, the last in my stack is going to be our lone purple stormtrooper. He's back here, cowering in fear. He's going to start cowering in this direction, so he's going to move, and then he is going to. Uh, he's just going to move up to about here, so that he can hang out and hopefully go get a point next round. Okay. All right, cast into the stack. Where the stack has to be, and it is these vets. They have three suppression on them. I'm going to take off two. Ooh, wow, that. It's so only one action, but I'll take the the nice removal there. Yeah, that's pretty solid. Think about just shooting those. Uh, Hmm. I don't know now. I thought I knew what I wanted to do, Don. But now I'm questioning everything. Ooh, he's looking at Aiden. I can't reach Aiden. I can reach Aiden with my heavy if I really wanted to. Yeah. He really wants to suppress her. Yeah, I'm just thinking. I'm, I'm going to shoot a Stormtrooper, I think. I just got to figure out which one. Okay. There's three regular troopers in there, so that's three black dice, four white with the critical two, searching to hit, heavy cover. Stormtroopers, see what we get. Well, I'll take three Man, crits. All three crits for you. I'll take that. That's a, that's a don't know if I've ever seen. This will drop the cover, but three crits come in the stormtroopers. Two a black down. one, two there down. There Cassian. He's got the ability where he can't be suppressed. We're going to see if we can roll some off just for next turn. We get one off. He'll keep two, but once again, with with Jin's card, he doesn't have to worry about that. We're going to move him. He's got tackle, and he's still in that range two config, and we just got to get... We don't have to get very far. Yeah, not far at all. Um, I think I'll move him just slightly farther than that. So let's... uh. Well, I'm torn now, guys, as I'm talking out loud in the cameras, and I don't know what I want to do. Um, I think I want to touch this building, though. That makes sense for cover purposes. So we're going to touch this building here, and we're sure. going to shoot him. Alrighty. Two reds and a black. We have to aim from tactical. Uh, since I moved, he no longer has cover from the building, but he still has cover from suppression. So light yes, cover, sir. marksmanship, search to hit, all the fun stuff. Well. Why do you even need it? Lose one, one anyway, but it's two pierce one, right? So I don't think I'm going to spend the AMC. So yeah, two pierce one. We'll just lose this one to cover. That's the unit. Okay, that's, that's Our nice. vets, defense held up good, got a little thinned out there, but uh, Cassian and the vets were able to wipe out that Stormtrooper unit, put a few wounds on the Aiden as well, and dispatch the... Oh, no, they ran away. They're the Death Troopers. I forgot that. There's a lot, there's a lot of troops in this little cluster there. Mm -hmm. What's going on for? It's getting, it's getting exciting over here. Okay, round four, we have Boss with Reptilian Rampage. During Boss activation, we have two attacks. If he does, he may suffer a wound to perform a free move action if he wants. I went, trust goes both ways. It's Jinnah 1 Trooper, Jinnah gains Inspire 2, and when Jinnah Urso issues an order to a friendly Trooper unit, that unit gains teamwork Jinnah Urso. So Jin and Cassie now are teamworking it up. They have the orders on my side, Boss has the order on his side. Uh, I rolled a blank, so he gets to go first. I'm going to go with Boss. Um, I don't think I'm going to take a wound to move. I thought about wounding and moving and trying to shoot Cassie in. Six health, though. No, no aims. I gotta try to start taking out activations. That would be extremely hard to work on. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna shoot the sniper team first. We'll see what happens, and then we might shoot again. We'll see. Okay. You might shoot again? Well, I'm gonna shoot twice. I just don't know who I'm shooting. Mm, okay. All right, it's gonna be one red, four whites, surge to crit, uh, suppressive, pierce one, and two heavy cover plus snipers. Well, that's two crits, pierce one. Don't always get exactly what he needs. Those weren't even surges, were they? They were just natural no, crits. Just yeah. natural crits yeah. So that's the dead sniper team. So now we'll take the rest of the shot into the light cover currently. Uh, oh no, it's heavy cover. It's heavy cover. Pathfinders. Doesn't matter when you roll just crits. So that's a crit there. That's it, one crit. So just one crit, pierce one on the Pathfinders. Uh, I'll need your sense it so I can see if I can get rid of it. Or uh, duck and cover. Didn't work. Okay, we got special forces here. We're gonna see if we can rally anything off. Ooh, it went off, which is big. Sad panda for me. So I'm gonna recover to get Biston's gun back. Yep. Um, yeah, we're just. Let's, I can choose if I want this off. Um, we'll keep the one on there for defensive purposes. And we're gonna shoot everything into Miss Iden Verso. Okay, Biston is four whites and a black. I don't matter. She has no shields, and the other guys are two whites each, so four whites. Total of eight whites, one black. Search and hit heavy cover. Iden. It's a good good hit for you. These two will drop to cover. This will search your hit and go away. So we're looking at two crits remaining. Two crits for Aiden to deal with here. She'll block them both. Thank you, girl. All right, we're going to the stack here. It's Aiden, actually, which is awesome. 
She has five suppression. She's gonna roll off four of it. All right, um, what are we doing with two actions then? Guys, well, this is the guy who just whines about his dice. I've not nausea. actually been doing a lot of whining today, so I'm just, just hanging out there, I think. Um, so we will... He's gonna do something, I think. Uh, let me, give me a minute to think here, I'm sorry. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and tap offensive push. We're gonna move Aiden over here out of range of that sniper and make it a little harder for Cassian to shoot at her. Um, and then she will uh, get an aim from that and we will shoot into the um, Pathfinders. Okay, cool. All right, Pathfinders are gonna have heavy cover. I will have uh, two reds, two whites, and a black. And same token, critical one. Just two natty crits again. Just two natty crits. Let's just spend the aim to march missions. Ship that up to three crits. They've got one suppression on them. I'm going to take another one so I can roll a total of uh, five dice here instead of three. Let's see if I can get them to survive a little longer. We block that all helps. three. That helps a lot. We're going to say we've got the pikes. They're going to take an aim. We're going to shoot in the boss. See if we can do anything there. All right, shooting into my poor boss. We've got five black sugar guys, two blacks, they're red again for the disruptor. With an aim and a surge token into no cover. Boss. Well, it looks good for a second there. Yeah, that surge surgeon would have been real nice for you. We'll spend the aim on these two, and then we'll spend the surge on this one. So it's just it's just gonna be four. Just four for Mr. Boss. That's four wounds. We go to the stack here. It's special forces. It's gonna be our two remaining death troopers. They're gonna take a dodge and a standby. Makes sense. And that will be done. Okay, go to my stack. We got special forces. We'll take an aim and we'll shoot to Boss, who's just barely in range. Five. My poor little lizard. Heavy in the light, black and white. Pierce one, surgeon hit. That's one hit there. Spend the aim, hoping for the best. No. Just as, no suppression from some rage. We go to the stack here. It's going to be the white stormtroopers. They will aim and shoot the vets. Okay. All right, we got two reds, three whites from our stormtroopers. The vets have one storm suppression still, so they will have light cover. I have an aim precise one, surge to hit. We will spend the aim on these three, and we'll get one after cover, or two after cover, because one will get eaten by yep. the over there, and two vets. Oh look, we got the, the core after trying too many times. Ooh, get it. Oh, get an action. Oh boy, it's, this is what we need. I'm moving. All right. What do we need to shoot with our whopping couple dice? Five dice? Just a couple? And the heavy cover? No, I'm good. All I'm right. Done. Good. All right, go to the stack here. It's going to be our um, pikes. We're going to double move them, so we'll hop over to here. And then we will keep... Uh, we'll just hang out hang out at the end of the building here. Over there. He changed his mind. He didn't move out for the cameras. Don't want to Don't want to give the, uh, the other pikes an easy shot on them next round. We're going to go with Jin. We're going to elect to uh, keep it. We do have Inspire too, so we'll remove one there and um, one here. Sure. Why not? Thanks to my lovely card. Um, She's very inspirational. And then we move back to where she was earlier. Okay. Well, she moved the whole moved building the whole apparently. Building. We'll just move back to that corner she was at earlier before she's wrapped back around, and we're going to see if we can shoot Mr. Boskos, which we should be able to. I would imagine. Yep, pretty easily. Pretty easily. Two blacks and a white. Um, so light. crit, pierce one. So one pierce one. One for boss. Right, last of my sack is my purple stormtrooper. He's going to move here and move over here. Okay. That'll be him. Okay, Cass is going to go next. He's going to move up to this corner right here, touching it. Mm -hmm. Just mm -hmm. a slight move. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to aim for that move, of course. And we'll use our range two gun and shoot the boss if we finish him off. The two reds in the black, Pierce one, Marks and Ship. He's got no cover out there. Okay, um, this is going to be three Pierce one. You need all three to live. We need three shields here. And that's it. Okay, we got to do something a little silly here, I think. We're going to take these vets. That's all we have left. We're going to move to this corner here right here. We're going to do this range four shot into that. Uh, yeah, I, I forgot to leave him back just enough because I lost the game. It's just four white dice, critical two. We're really hoping for a surge or a crit to pop up on these dice to make him at least roll defense dice. We did get one natty crit. The hit's gonna go to cover. So it's up to hit whether he gets that natty block. It was a no, block. Is the next one gonna hurt him? That's not gonna be a block now. No. End of round number four. Uh, what, what a swing of a round. I yep. was I was hundred percent sure I lost because of boss having the bounty, but boss stayed and shot. And in doing so, Cassian, um, Jin actually put through what, one wound, I think it was. 
And then Kassin got through the last two to take out Bosk, who was right yeah. there. Bosk rolled zero, zero defensive blocks. Yep, he didn't roll any. And he yeah. dropped the bounty, which was the big thing. And then I took a nice little, I measured to see if I can still get yeah, to that middle. I, but can I, I shoot him and kill him? And I killed his unit. So, so now he has to pull this unit over here to score this, which means currently he's going to only have one, two, three, right? Yep. Three that can score versus mine. One, two, three, four. They can still make it, and they can still make it with Dauntless, too, so they're not too worried about discretion. So he's calling it there. Yep, I lost. I lost because I'm an idiot. I was gonna, I was gonna move the pikes over and engage Cassian that last round, and that would have saved Bosk. And it would have saved Bosk. Changed the game, and then I wouldn't have. I would probably have paid a little more attention and not killed that guy off for no reason. So I lost the game myself, which is always cool. Uh, I, I do that a lot. <laughs> I just you haven't done it in a while, but uh, yeah, I, I, I will agree stupid. with him. Um, stupid moves. He had some good moves and good shots, and I just, Iden was rolling hot. The, the Death Troopers felt like they usually fall against Pierce, but your other stuff was giving me a, li a little hardness besides those ISFs and those deaths. You're, you're Cassian, or not your Cassian, your you're Iden didn't want to die, and I was having a hard time thinking through, but I had just enough to keep it going, and then once boss, once, I think actually the funny thing is, I got so, like, blinders on Iden, I wanted to kill her because I got those couple wounds early, mm -hmm. and then she just wouldn't take any, but then once you made her not a target, funny enough... I was like, wait a minute, Bosk has a bounty. I yeah, I was, probably shoot I was wondering why you kept shooting Aiden when Boss was standing there with a bounty token. That was, was was really going to be like what was winning me the game because I was killing your big heavy things. Yeah, you were. But then I made a stupid mistake and I lost the game on purpose. So This this guy right here usually has an MVP game for me. Him today didn't roll good on his one attack and he just... He, just, just, he melted pretty good. He just bent over and let, let, him, let me dish some dice. Mark II is not going to go at least once either. Really hurt too. I could not pull them to save my life. You had some good alpha strikes there, but they, I wanted him to shoot them, not something else. So that part worked. I just thought I would at least get a shot with one of them. But yeah, yeah, that was that, so that was, was good, good. But and these, I mean, these guys wasted, didn't hit anything. I wasted the full tax strike to kill two. You did, and that's that's why I was okay with them. Like at least I got him to burn that girly good card with, with just yeah. Mark IIs. They were less than forty points each. I wasn't too worried, but the the K two hurt. Yeah, the K two hurt early. Close game. Hope you guys enjoyed this game. Uh, the key word of the day is going to be... Um, I don't even know. I'm fr so frustrated right now with myself. Um, let's let's with go with... Uh, let's go with... Uh, I don't know. Danger Sense. Danger Sense helped win me the game. Let's go with Danger Sense. Put that in with double entries here. Um, if you haven't got a chance, go check out some of the unboxing videos we've done. Uh, more and more videos coming. We're trying to get more out for you guys besides the Sunday drop. Uh, Don's going on a nice little vacation soon, so we'll see how many we can record for bonuses. But maybe, maybe Josh from Day Squared Wolf will stop on by for a video yeah, or Josh, two. Josh loves playing Patreon with us. He does. Actually, he does because he doesn't have to make a list. That's very true. You guys have a good night. Thanks. Bye.